I have a machine added to the domain which is having SCCM server I mean only the primary server in this context uh, added to it so I want to add this machine to SCCM inventory also this is my SCCM server uh, if you go to the assets and compliance if you go to the this is a collection test machines if you go to the devices you can see win 10 x64 is there the machine if you want to check the name of this just type host name that machine is available here but if you see there is no SSM client installed on it so that's why it is showing no now I will uh, right click on this and click on install client so just click next um, just click next go to the defaults and uh, within a few minutes uh, the client application will start installing here uh, you can check that uh, by clicking on this and click on client shop detail or you can go to this monitoring also there is a client status if you click on this all these are uh, related to the clients which are already added then only you will get full inventory details uh, you want to check whether it started or not so the client setup file will get downloaded c windows ccm setup the setup will be downloaded here oh my god I've kept semicolon there instead of colon. Let me pop. After some time, uh, if even during the installation, you can check in the task manager also for this uh, uh, CCM setup.exe. So once it is installed. Uh, if you refresh the assets and components page here, you can see instead of no, it will be showing yes now. And uh, there will be one control panel icon called configuration manager. And uh, one start menu shortcut. Software center. Software center is kind of play store. So some applications will be deployed as with the required option and some applications will be deployed with uh, available option which are uh, deployed with available option will be visible in the software center directly from this you can install and uninstall those applications so thanks for watching my video